Welcome to the iCatch booth at the NSF Convergence Accelerator Expo 2022. In this video, the iCatch team will share more information about iCatch rapid genomic tests. For an overview of iCatch species identification tools, or to learn more about the iCatch smartphone app, check out the other videos available at our booth. You can also learn more about iCatch by joining us during a scheduled live session. A central challenge impeding U.S. efforts to combat illegal, unreported, and unregulated fishing or IUU fishing is the inability to rapidly and reliably determine the species identity of whole fish, fillets, and other fish parts across all steps of seafood supply chains, including on the water, at ports, and in stores. Traditionally, species identification is performed by examining external morphological features. However, even for well-trained experts, morphology-based identification can be difficult because many groups of marine species are morphologically conserved. This becomes increasingly problematic when diagnostic morphological features have been removed. iCatch combines genomics with AI to create a groundbreaking, innovative tool for species identification. The iCatch Rapid Genomic Tests will be available as pre-packaged test kits that can easily be deployed in a wide range of fisheries settings, including by fisheries observers on boats, law enforcement agents at ports, and seafood buyers at supplier markets. The first step of an iCatch Rapid Genomic Test is to collect a DNA sample. This sample is collected using a swab contained in the Rapid Genomic Test Kit. Samples can be collected from whole fish, fillets, and other fish parts. During the second step of an iCatch rapid genomic test, a swab containing a DNA sample is swirled in a prepackaged buffer that contains the additional elements necessary for the test reaction to occur. Next, the buffer containing the DNA sample is added to a lateral flow device. This device contains a lateral flow test strip on which the test result develops. Finally, the test result develops on the lateral flow test strip. For both a positive and negative test result, a band will appear at the control region of the strip. However, for a positive test result, a second band will be present in the test region of the strip. Results for iCatch rapid genomic tests may take up to 30 minutes before results can be determined with the naked eye. To detect the color change associated with the bands significantly faster and more reliably than the human eye, the iCatch smartphone app automatically recognizes and records test strip results using artificial intelligence. Recorded test results improve the AI models used by iCatch and enable data-driven modeling for downstream decision-making in support of species-specific monitoring, management, and enforcement. By integrating cutting-edge genomics and AI into a seamless tool, iCatch achieves greater utility and user-friendliness than would be possible using each technology independently. We are developing iCatch tools to identify species encountered in key U.S. fisheries, including salmon, which had landings in 2019 worth $700 million, with the Pacific salmon fishery being the most valuable marine wild capture fishery in the U.S sharks, where high demand for fins incentivizes illegal trade, while enforcing existing regulations is limited by difficulty distinguishing species, especially from shark fins which fuel a global trade valued at $4.1 billion. Tuna, wherein consumers worldwide spent $40.8 billion on tuna products in 2018 alone, making tuna fisheries some of the most valuable in the world. And last shrimp, which ranks among the top five most valuable marine wild capture fisheries in the U.S., with landings in 2019 worth $400 million. By equipping users with smart species identification technology, iCatch is ready to revolutionize the way humans engage with marine fisheries and support a sustainable blue economy. Learn more about iCatch at the iCatch website and through the additional videos available at the iCatch Expo booth or join us for one of our live sessions. To realize our vision for this project, we need funding and an expression of interest from members of the investment community. So, we appreciate your support towards that end. Thank you.